Hey, today I've got an urgent warning for all new truck drivers and all truck drivers. I want to tell you the four things you should never do as a truck driver. So let's get into it. The number one thing you never want to do is you never want to go down a mountain too fast. Listen, you can go down a mountain a hundred times too slow. Don't go down at one time too fast. Too many times have I seen truck drivers go over mountains. They're not in the right gear when they're going down. And all of a sudden the brakes start heating up. Truck's getting faster and faster and faster. That is not a situation you want to be in. So, you know, I see it all the time. Trucks get wound up. They go over the mountain too fast. And then they try to get it back into the right gear and they lose control. And now they're going too fast. They're burning up the brakes. The best thing you can do is hope hope you can find a spot that you can stop but them brakes cool off so you can get the right gear or you're gonna have to take a runaway ramp but it's something you definitely do not want to do so make sure drivers you never go down a mountain too fast you're never gonna die from going too slow you're gonna die from going too fast the one time you do it can be the one time that you don't get to go home all right listen the second thing you never want to do and this should be common sense don't text and drive this goes for cars and for big trucks don't text and drive drivers it's that simple if you're texting and driving you're an idiot that's simple as that please don't do that i see so many accidents out here where people are not paying attention they're on their phone they're texting and then wham if you watch some of my videos i've got some videos out there drivers ramming in the back of trucks and running off the side of the mountains and roads all of a sudden you come right up onto a car and you're looking at your phone and you can kill somebody not to mention you can go to jail uh, and, and then have it on your heart forever that you murdered somebody because you had to get that last text. So drivers, please don't text and drive. That's the number two thing you want to do. Want to do. Number three, you don't want to drive tired. Don't drive tired. I know with the ELDs, all these trucking companies, they got it all figured out where you can take a 30 minute break after eight hours, you get 10 hours done. But only you can decide if you're tired or not. You know, I've, I've, I've come off a 34-hour break, drove a couple hours, and I'm, I'm getting tired. It happens. So when you're tired, pull over, take a nap. Nothing is better than a quick 20, 30-minute nap. Make sure you're getting your rest. This is very important, drivers. Again, too many times I see drivers losing their lives because, you know why? They're just driving tired. All right, the fourth thing on it is driving too fast for conditions. You know, especially in this winter driving, we'll see a lot of this in the winter. Drivers, I don't know what makes you think that you can drive the speed limit or over the speed limit in snowy, icy conditions. But you're going to see it. You're going to see it every year, and it seems like it gets worse every year. Even this goes for cars, too. When it's icy, snowy out there, stay below the speed limit. You're going to see the driver that's flying around you, and then you're going to see him spinning out, wrecking. There's no reason, listen, to first lose our lives out here. When it's raining and there's a lot of water on the road, just slow down. There's no sense in it. Truck driving can be very dangerous, but it's also we got to use our common sense practices. So I hope this helped you out. These are my four things that we should never do, truck drivers. So hopefully you paid attention to this. If you got some value from it, hit that like button. Leave me a comment. Listen, I love comments. All a lot of drivers do drivers read the comments. If you've got some advice for a driver, please leave a comment in the comment section. Hit that subscribe button. This is Trucking Life with Sean. Let's get it.